The current foundation is an inexpensive and effective farming setup intended for swift construction, ensuring a smoother experience for your game reset. Employing this foundation for crafting herbal teas, trading hemp, and generating a continuous stream of valuable scrap will make you wish you had begun earlier. Not only does it serve as an ideal starting point for solo or duo players, but this base is also adaptable to accommodate groups of any size, with effortless replication and expansion options. Consider adding an additional level to stack your farming area areas or constructing multiple smaller bases to alternate between. It's easy to build. You'll need minimal resources to construct the house. Place four square foundations and one triangular foundation. Surround them with walls. Install a cupboard doors. Upgrade the structure. Add a ceiling and upgrade it. Divide the space into storage areas for resources and garden beds. Install the doorways at the end. After setting up the garden beds, pay close attention to avoid having to rebuild the house. I'll also immediately set up a main door, create an airlock, and place a pump and a battery near the exit. You can enclose the battery and pump with walls or doors. Arrange the storage area for resources and components for easy access to the tool chest and workbench. Install two large boxes accordingly, or several small ones. You can also fit a first or second level workbench in the same area. Install it accordingly, and you can add another ceiling with half walls where you can place two more large boxes for component storage. Note that if you want to install a second level workbench, you'll have to dismantle this structure. If you plan on using a high level workbench, simply avoid upgrading this structure. Install the garden beds in a way that allows three of them to fit and then install the doorways. Use double doors or garage doors. Next, I moved on to installing the electrical system. Connect the solar panels to the battery and also set up a campfire for convenience when entering the house. Hang two light bulbs in the middle and connect them to the battery through a switch. I connected the pump to the last light bulb. Afterward, I installed the irrigation system. It's straightforward, so watch the video for instructions. Check if all the garden beds are well lit and watered. Well, as for the juicy, good gene output, that's another story. If you want me to show you how to get the best gene to exchange for scrap, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. Have a great time, everyone. Goodbye.